What is going on? Welcome back to Fish on Luke. Tara's back from Canada. We're gonna go chuck some worms. We're gonna go pitch some jigs. I don't know what we're gonna catch today, but I heard her hit the rocks down here, so she must be ready. We'll see you on the water. All right, guys, we got to the spot. I'm gonna give you an idea of what we're fishing when we're targeting these walleye on the river. We're on an outside bend right now, and there's kind of a big eddy, and then there's a push, and there's a seam. And we're kind of in the deep pocket on a corner. That's pretty much what we're targeting, super shallow water for these walleyes. And uh, I'm actually throwing a quarter ounce custom jig head with a bee fishing milk white twister tail, one of my go-tos for river fishing for walleye. And that is also paired with the brand new Catch the Fever Precision Cast Rod. This is an IM7 graphite rod, tapered top grip. It is seven foot medium light. It's designated crappie rod, but this rod's literally gonna be the perfect walleye rod for jigging here on the river. And obviously that's just paired with a president, uh, Fluger president reel, nothing crazy, just eight pound braid. So I'm gonna pitch this, I'm gonna be dragging through the mud. We're gonna be lifting and dragging, just waiting to see what they want when they eat the fish. We're gonna get to fishing. We're gonna catch some fish for you guys. Stay tuned. There's one. Ooh. That hit it real nice. Real nice. This fish just inhaled this crankbait. Switch to a crankbait. That's a nice walleye. <coughs> the river water in your eye. That's a great walleye. Just annihilated it. What I'm doing with this crankbait, let me grab it here. Right there. It's like an 18 inch walleye. Crush this crankbait. Uh, dragging it through the mud. Once again, just bouncing it off the mud. Nothing crazy and it smoked it. So what I think we're gonna do is I'm gonna put Tara on one of these crankbaits too. She can probably hook one of these up herself. And uh, I'm just gonna keep dragging the mud. I think we're gonna kill this one. Okay, YouTube. I think we're gonna keep this one and process it, okay? Um, Tara wants a couple fish tonight, so we're gonna do that. Beautiful river walleye for the win. I'm gonna get this unhooked in the live well. Tara's gonna get rigged up. We're gonna get back to dragging some, I guess we're dragging crankbaits on the river today. There we go. It's a big, oh, a big walleye. We got a jumbo on. This might be a netter, and I don't have the net ready. It's I... definitely going to be a netter. Okay. Yeah, just okay. Yeah, you're good. We got ourselves a big walleye on. Yep, it's gonna be large. How big is it? Is the question. On the catch the fever rod, it's gonna be a huge walleye. I haven't caught one on this rod yet. Oh, it's big, 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 big walleye. That's close to 10 pounds. That's a big one. I'm taking a break. You guys don't get to see this until I get this hook out. You guys need to see this fish. All right, you guys need to check out this giant walleye. Oh my gosh. Slobber Minnesota River walleye on the brand new Catch the Fever precision casting rod let me tell you it felt good i felt that bite perfectly if you want one catch the fever.com code luke 10 save yourself 10 percent but we're gonna get this on the bump board i guess 28 real big fish we're gonna get this on the bump board get a couple oh saved it <gasps> we're gonna get her, get her on the bump board get some pictures and then uh we'll show you guys the release on this fish it was 27 inches, not as big as I thought. Obviously still probably close to eight, nine pounds. We're gonna get her back. She's feisty as all get out. That is a thick fish. 
Holy smokes. And that is why we come out here. Yep, swim away. But this river's great. You know, we, we started jigging, weren't getting anything. Ended up uh, going to crankbaits, got one on the crankbait, and then switched back to the jig. And I think that was my first cast, I believe, with the jig again. So right in the mud, there she goes. Let me tell you, doesn't get old. Back to fishing. Ew. That was so weird. All right, Tara, it's hooked up. Whatever this is, it sucks it up right out of the mud. Did it really? Yeah, it felt. Does it feel pretty good? Oh, nice walleye. Nice walleye. Nice fish. Yes, I finally got one. <laughs> She's been wanting it. And she got it. Let's go. Took it up right out of the mud? Yeah, it felt like I was dragging mud and then it kept swimming. And there was a fish was there. A fish. <laughs> Surprise! Who would have thought? Yay! It's a sweet one. I'm just gonna, wow. gonna hold him like That's this. It's about a 16 incher. <laughs> <I'm gonna hold. laughs> it's a spunky little guy. Yeah, it might have dropped, but we're keeping it, so it don't matter. But if you guys yeah. don't know, this is Tara. Hi! She, and this is my She fish. likes to catch fish. And uh, that's a nice walleye on the jig. Thanks. I think we'll uh, we'll put this one in the live well, and uh, I think uh, she got her walleye. I think we are going to call this a finish to the night. It's good to have her back from Canada. My fisher partner's back in the boat, so we're gonna we're gonna be fishing this weekend, or I'm gonna be fishing this weekend. If you guys did enjoy this video, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. New channel, new growth. Time to party. We'll see you on the next video. Fish on. Fish on. Ha <laughs>